YouTube Chicks <laughs> Get ready You know what to do Chicks Tell us to Chicks Smooth Hey Chicks Smooth Appreciate all the coverage that you been doing I've been watching your shit for a while I just subscribed to your shit too bro at this point, we gotta give Adam22 the Olympic gold medal of being a hater. With this level of dedication of hating anything AD and T-Rail does, there's nobody else in the running this year. Now regardless of which side you guys chose after AD left no jumper, you gotta admit that their initial back and forth was entertaining. Just like any other major fallouts or major breakups, things got pretty nasty between AD and Adam. Now after AD and Pun caught Desto Dub out at a concert, they stopped going back and forth with Adam because they realized what's at stake. Somebody could easily get hurt and you can easily get tricked out of your position. And I'll give Adam22 credit as well. He came on stream and waved the white flag to AD and T-Rail. But as of lately, maybe Adam22 has seen AD and T-Rail continue to succeed because I'm not sure why Adam is still keeping tabs on AD and T-Rail. Now over the weekend on one of their live streams they teased about a huge announcement coming before they even got a chance to announce what it was adam 22 was in super saiyan hitting form and he took to instagram to hit on him okay word on the streets is that one of the custers got a radio gig and they're really really proud of themselves and they're bragging about it on uh, their stream and they're so hyped up um just want to clarify if you have your own stream your own podcast and then you have to go and get a side gig doing a radio show. This is not what we call a W. The goal is to be an independent boss, not a corporate cog in the machine working for some corporate monolith. And don't be out here trotting this around, acting like this is something to be proud of. You know how many times I've had offers to do a radio show and I looked at the dollar amount and I was just like, oh, yeah. That does not align with what I got going on. If you own your own restaurant, and then you go and get a side gig working at McDonald's, it's not a W, it's an L. So let's just make that perfectly clear. You're still falling off. Now, AD briefly addressed Adam22 on Instagram, and then he posted the rest on Snapchat. I'm only going to play a small clip from AD Snapchat. Please make sure you guys go follow AD on Snapchat. PSA, white boy, wrong again. <laughs> I don't know who's feeding you information, but uh, if you want to know what that announcement is, I would tell you to tune in the back on Fig, but we both know you're going to be watching. Yeah, you'll see the announcement, but uh, <laughs> wrong again, white boy. You had the perfect team, and you blew it. We can shift the blame on this person, this person, this person, this person. Gotta look yourself in the mirror, man. The truth of the matter is, when I came to that platform, everything boosted. The whole model of talent, of everything, was based on me. But you want to know the difference between me and a lot of people that you didn't employ and came across I've never been a yes man never been a yes man never been uh, afraid to tell you when I think things was wrong because uh, that's what real niggas do in real situations I didn't come to that platform for no money I wasn't starving for no money when I came to that platform. Now, 100% grateful for uh, the opportunity because, shit, life is better now since being on that platform. I can't lie. Part of the chapter. It's a part of the journey. Now, AD also went on to tell Adam22 he has no real friends. He doesn't know who's with him genuinely and who's around him for the money. Have you guys ever been fired from a job and on top of that you had to deal with an injury? That's exactly how my first job out of college went. I was working at a major hospital in my city, strained my back while lifting a patient. Boy did that suck you guys. Briefly I thought about getting a lawyer but I thought it was going to be way too expensive. And coming right out of college, bro I was broke. 
Fast forward to now, boy was I foolish. I could have been rich, you guys. I had no clue about companies like Morgan & Morgan that are completely free. Yes, free, unless you win. No, seriously, you guys, there's no upfront cost. There's no sign up fees. If you don't win your case, you pay them nothing, zero dollars. These guys are the largest injury law firm in America. If any of you guys out there ever got seriously injured, your case could be worth millions. Guys, I'm telling you, please don't be like me. They make it super easy for you guys now. You can start your claim right now with Morgan & Morgan at ForThePeople.com backslash chicks or by scanning the QR code right here. Now, excuse me, you guys. I gotta go yell at my parents for not knowing this and me not being rich right now. I'll be back. And finally, AD also told Adam22 on Snapchat that it's getting obsessive and sad. Which, when you look at it, it kind of makes sense. I think Adam knows that he gets good engagement when he goes back and forth with AD and T-Rail. AD also called out Adam22 for ducking smoke with academics. He told Adam that he always tucks his tails anytime that it comes with anything to do with academics. At this point, man, I think Adam just misses AD and T-Rail. Even though Adam has a show he's doing with WAC 100, you can tell that the energy is not the same. Even though Adam has the bigger platform numbers wise, it definitely looks like AD and T Rail's individual platforms are now starting to gain more momentum in the industry than No Jumper. You guys get in the comments below. What do you guys make of Adam 22 still trying to beef with AD and T Rail? Post your comments below. Subscribe to my channel, like this video. I'll see you guys later, man.